Hello, this is my honest review of the Athena and the Billy razors. I'm going to start with the Billy. The Billy I've used for about a year and a half. Um, it's they come in a wide variety of colors. The handles are lightweight. They're comfortable. They're all plastic. There's little grips here for your thumb. Uh, the blades are small. They're shaped well. They're comfortable. Uh, it comes with this little holder. Very cute, dainty little holder. Magnets are nice so the razor doesn't fall. Um, it also has a magic putty on the back of this, so you can twist these off, you can ball the putty back up, and then you can apply it in different places in your shower and move your razor around. So if you don't like where you hang it, you can move it around. The Athena, um, I actually prefer this razor more now. It's a little bit heavier, just slightly. Um, it's a little bit sturdier. It's got metal on the top here, which I like because when I first got my Billy handle, my first handle, it actually sprang apart. The pieces kind of shot out, but it was easy to put it back together, and I still have that handle. I just like the blue color better. Um, this one, the Athena doesn't come in as wide a variety of colors. There's black, white, pink, blue, I believe. Uh, there might be a couple more, but they're not quite as cute and dainty as the Billy, but it does have a variety of colors. The holder, the holder here is also magnetic. There's a little lip here. Um, but this can't be moved around the shower. It's held on by some 3M like double-sided foam tape. So once it's there, you can't move it unless you get new tape. Um, as for the blades, I prefer these blades. These blades, for some reason for me, they tend to rust more, but I think it might be something that I'm using on my skin that's causing it to rust. So I don't know if it's the product or not. Uh, but there is a serum on here and it really keeps me from having razor burn. It really makes your skin smooth. So I do really prefer these blades to the Billy blades. As for the blades when they come in each month, this is the packaging for the Billy blades, which I don't like this because this is a lot of plastic. I'm not sure why they chose this packaging, but this is not recyclable where I live. I actually prefer the Athena packaging because this is recyclable where I live. I can recycle this. And if you look on the packaging, there is actually a little recycle emblem on this packaging. So this, I think, is more widely recyclable. As for the pricing, for the Billy, I paid $9 a month for four blades, which came to $2.25 per blade, which is affordable. The Athena, um, you actually can't get the shipments as often, so I have to get... 12 blades every nine months for $27, but they're also $2.25 per blade. Um, but the Billy may be better for someone who wants to get them more often and pay less. Uh, but I like the fact that the Athena, I get bigger shipments, so I have less uh, waste coming, packaging materials and things. So I don't have to worry about disposing those and recycling them and all that if I just get more razors less often. Um, both lines carry other products. The Billy has shaving creams um, and some other things available. They have a cool little carrier that you can get to travel with it. Because uh, if you do sit it down, for some reason it does seem to stick to the tub. Like if you travel to a hotel and you just leave it lay on the tub, it seems to stick. So there's a little travel case you can buy. I don't see one available yet for the Athena, but the Athena, they have more products available. They have lotions and things. They also have a wellness line. They have like vitamins, uh, nutritional things. Uh, they have some things for um, uh, women monthly time products. So there's a few things uh, that you can get from each brand that are not just the razor. So if you're into that kind of thing too, you may want to get more products in your shipments each time. So um, as for me, I really like the Billy, but I do prefer the Athena. And it's mostly just because of that razor burn. I don't have that issue. So... I will be sticking to the Athena, uh, but I'll have this information in the comments and there should be some referral links there as well. Thanks for watching.